Facts of Life, 1979-1988, cast colon, then and now 2023. George Clooney is George Burnett when he appeared in the film he was 24 years old and is now 62 years old. Clooney still participates with many exciting film projects and art activities. Door. I know. We had a fire. Sorry. Listen, was my paper delivered here by mistake? Paper? Yeah, my newspaper. Uh, a lot of postage, strange lettering. Oh, what? Oh, yeah, I can't believe even you are displaced from your office. I'm displaced. I, uh, everything's going. It's just, it's, it's wrong, man. Felice Schachter as Nancy Olson when she appeared in the film. She was 16 years old, and her current image is 60 years old. <laughs> Whatever for? <laughs> we were going to meet in New York. Now he says he can't. He's stuck with relatives. Definitely upset because I was the first person, first not person, after Charlotte, the first girl cast on the show, and, and I remembered them casting around me like little... Kim Fields as Dorothy Tutti Ramsey when she appeared in the film she was 10 years old, and her current image is 54 years old. Kim Fields still participates in many exciting movie projects and artistic activities. <laughs> no, no honey, I've never been more serious. In all these years, I've never forgotten you. Because your Netflix special, when I told you, remember, I told you and I met you. And I was like, that white suit is kick ass. And so I wore one just for you. Nancy McKean is Joe Ponichek when she participated in the film. She was 14 years old and is now 57 years old, still participating in many TV projects. Thanks, honey. <laughs> oh, by the way, they were marigolds. Right, marigolds. What do I know about flowers? In my neighborhood, the state flowers asphalt. <laughs> <laughs> they are such lovely dancers and they are such true gentlemen as is my lovely partner here and uh, that particular dance was so so much fun. Mackenzie Astin as Andy Moffat when he appeared in the film he was 12 years old and now he is 50 years old. Astin participates in many exciting film projects and artistic activities. Wait just a second here. Nobody's helping anybody do my job. Mrs. Garrett you're paying me good money to do this. Not great money, but good money. Doing great. I don't mind taking care of Jack. I like... I like being... Julie Ann Haddock as Cindy Webster when she appeared in the film she was 14 years old and is now 58 years old. Huh? <laughs> I don't know. But I'll tell you one thing. If Blair ever says I don't look feminine again, I'm just gonna have to punch her out. <laughs> And because I was a kid, too, I also missed my school, my friends. And so when it didn't go beyond, you know, the first. Julie Pikarski is Sue Ann Weaver when she appeared in the film. She was 16 years old and is now 60 years old. This IQ thing, there's nothing to it. Doesn't mean a thing. It doesn't if you're at the top of the list like Nancy. And I don't hear her complaining. You walk in this room and you sit down and there's about... 50 other blonde hair, blue-eyed girls. Very humbling experience. Mindy Comb was Natalie Green when she participated in the film. She was 13 years old, and now is her image at the age of 57, participating and succeeding in many TV and movie projects. What are you raising for? Two boys does not beat queens. I know that, and you know that, but how do we know that she knows that? Can we just talk about how good okay. of an actress yes. I am? Thank you. Jump back. Boom. Boom. You got good, right? You were the worst, but at the end, you're supposed to end up good, aren't you? I learned some skills. Good. It's called making good television. Charlotte Ray as Edna Garrett when she starred in the film she was 53 years old, and sadly on August the 5th, 2018, aged 92 years old. She was diagnosed with bone cancer. Thanks, but I don't need that dress. What? You mean you're, you're gonna go to the Harvest Ball like that? I mean, who ever heard of queens and jeans? And then I was doing uh, the Eddie Capra mystery uh, at Universal, and I got a call from Jane Murray. Over Chorus Leachman as Beverly Ann Stickle in the movie she was 60 years old, and sadly on January the 27th, 2021, Leachman died in her sleep. The cause of death was a stroke, and COVID-19 was a contributing factor. Oh, so glad to see you. Oh, you aren't married yet, are you? Oh, who is this man? Huh? What do you know about? Realize what you're really doing. You're saving the earth. 
I don't eat animals. You don't want to either. Be a little progressive. Thank you.